everybody. I'm Nicole Fecto, uh, chairman of the Berwick Planning Board. I am also a longtime Berwick resident and property owner, as well as a longtime local real estate agent. Today, I just wanted to quickly talk about the comprehensive plan. Um, there's been a lot of discussion in town lately about development. One opinion is that there is much too much development going on, and another opinion is that there's not enough housing in Berwick. So. Um, I wanted to talk a little bit more about how our government actually runs and how development is regulated and um, how the planning for that goes. So we have something called the Comprehensive Plan, and God help us, ours hasn't been updated in a long time. It was originally written in 1991. There was a 2004 update, I believe. You can see, see how often I refer to mine because it's um, completely marked up. A 2004 update. And then in 2014, we had the Envision Berwick um, did a, basically an addendum to our comprehensive plan. All this is available online. The comprehensive plan is a plan for the town mapped out very thoroughly, actually, and it's all based on data. And the reason we have this is because we don't want to make decisions for our town based on opinions and based on what's hot at the moment. Um, the comprehensive plan is developed using uh, a litany of data. You may have gotten, no, you definitely got, um, and I think this was, when did we send this out? In 2019, when the comprehensive plan committee first started meeting again, we sent a survey out to everybody in the town of Berwick. And it asks all kinds of very in-depth questions. I believe it was also available online so you could fill it out there. All of that information, as well as traffic data, housing studies, population data are all compiled and looked at by a, um, a committee based on, uh, based up, a committee made up of professionals, um, professionals and regular townspeople. So the, all of that data is compiled. It takes years to make a comprehensive plan. So the committee has been meeting since 2019. They're still meeting. They still need volunteers. They meet via Zoom. It's very easy to volunteer for this plan. If you feel very strongly about development in Berwick or some other issue that you don't want to see or you do want to see in the future, now is the time to act on that and contribute to your comprehensive plan because that is what dictates. So in the comprehensive plan, you can go online and read ours. It's, it's actually, it actually is pretty interesting. But in here, it tells you, what the objectives are, what the policies need to be, who needs to implement those policies, and that's exactly how this town is run. So um, to, to say, oh, the planning board needs to stop development, well, if you're familiar with our comprehensive plan and how our town government works, you'll understand that that um, is not exactly how that works. So I um, encourage everybody to educate yourselves by looking at the comp plan by attending a comp plan committee meeting. You can attend online. You don't have to participate, but see what's going on. Because there's a lot of people who are very passionate about their opinions. And there is a way to, to have your opinion turned into an actual plan. This is the way to do it. Uh, that is all I have for you. If you have questions about the comprehensive plan, please go to the town manager, James Bellissimo, with all of your questions.